Hello everyone, it's Old Guardian here. Yuxeron's Chaos is now here with the fall of Ulduar miniset, but is the whole of Ulduar miniset a good thing to purchase in Hearthstone? Should you spend some of your money or your gold in order to buy the fall of Ulduar miniset? Let's take a look at that. Fall of Ulduar consists of 38 new cards, 4 legendary cards, 1 epic, 17 rares, 16 commons. This is the same rarity spread as the past two minisets, so nothing has changed there. Normal version of the miniset can be purchased for $14.99 or 2000 gold, also same price. All golden version can be purchased for $69.99 or 10,000 gold. And the golden miniset also includes a bonus diamond legendary, which is a bonus Yogg-Saron in diamond. So, how good of a deal is this? If we take a look at the regular miniset, then the regular miniset overall, it would cost you 11,880 dust to craft all the cards in the miniset. And if you disenchant all of those cards, you get 2,640 dust. Because on average from a regular pack, you get around 100 dust worth of cards if you disenchant them all. Then for 2,000 gold, you get 2,600 dust. So yeah, that's a pretty sweet deal. Also for 15 bucks, you get 2,600 dust. So again, it's a really good deal. Also, it's much better to buy the miniset than to try to open these cards from packs. Because if you try to open them from packs, okay, you get the commons in 9 packs. Also, you get the epics in 9 packs. You get the rares in around 30 packs. But in order to get all the 4 legendary cards, you'd have to open more than 70 packs on average. So, yeah, not worth trying to open these from packs, even though they are part of Titan's packs. But buying the miniset is a better deal. If we look at the golden miniset, then the golden miniset, crafting the golden miniset would cost you 56,000 dust. And disenchanting the full golden miniset gets you 12,200 dust. So for 70 bucks or 10,000 gold, 12,200 dust, again, you're getting more dust value from the golden miniset than you would get simply from buying packs. So again, it's a pretty good looking deal. But you're probably not going to buy the miniset just to disenchant all the cards. And in that regard, the miniset also delivers. Because already looking at the most expensive cards, Yogg-Saron Unleashed has already proven in the first day that it's a good card. It's a very strong card. You're going to play that in many decks that are very spell heavy because it offers them a great removal option. And playing something like Druid, you really, really want to put Yogg-Saron Unleashed into your Druid decks. Also, Soul Burner Varia which is an Undead Priest card. There's already a video on my channel about the new Undead Priest with Soul Burner Varia. Soul Burner Varia, definitely worth it as well if you want to play with Undead Priest. So there's a pair of very strong legendary cards in the set. We don't know yet about the Boria legendary card that might also be playable. So yeah, the set is looking really nice also when it comes to the performance of its strongest cards. So overall, the mini set is still a good deal. If you buy the regular miniset with money, you get 176 dust per dollar. And if you buy the golden one, you get 174 dust per dollar. And you also get the diamond card. So those are really good values. And for use value, I mean, miniset, these miniset cards are pretty strong. So yeah, you definitely want them. If you want just the dust, there are some bundle offers occasionally available in the shop that are of similar value, but none are really better. So even just considering the dust value, the miniset is still an excellent investment, which means that this miniset is one of the best things that you can spend your money on if you want to spend money on Hearthstone. Thank you for watching. Click like and subscribe if you enjoyed this. And a special thanks to all of my Patreon supporters, YouTube members and Twitch subscribers who make all of these videos possible.